The Nanda dynasty was an ancient Indian dynasty that originated in Magadha region during the 4th century BCE and lasted between 345 to 321 BCE. At its greatest extent, the empire ruled by the Nanda dynasty extended from Bengal in the east, to the Punjab region in the west and as far south as the Vindhya range. The rulers of this dynasty were famed for the great wealth which they accumulated. The Nanda Empire was later conquered by Chandragupta Maurya, founder of the Mauryan Empire. Topic: <inaudible> <inaudible> Establishment of the dynasty. According to Puranas, founder of Nanda dynasty was Mahapama Nanda, whereas Buddhist traditions name him Ugrasena. Mahapama, Ashutas, a Pali word for the purest, holiest, refer Henry Froude's Mahavamsa, Oxford University Press, who has been described in the Puranas as the destroyer of all the Kshatriyas, defeated many other kingdoms, including the Panchalas, Kassis, Haihayas, Kalingas, Asmakas, Kurus, Maithilas, Surasinas, and the Vithihatras, to name a few. He expanded his territory south of the Vindhya range into the Deccan Plateau. The Nandas, who usurped the throne of the Shishunaga dynasty c. 345 BCE, were thought to be of low origin. Mahapama Nanda was said in the Puranas to be the son of Mahanandine and Ashuda mistakenly referred as Shudra mother. <laughs> <laughs> Military The Nanda kings built on the foundations laid by their Haryanka and Shishunaga predecessors to create the first great empire of North India. To achieve this objective they built a vast army, consisting of 200,000 infantry, 20,000 cavalry, 2,000 war chariots and 3,000 war elephants at the lowest estimates. According to the Greek historian Plutarch, the size of the Nanda army was even larger, numbering 200,000 infantry, 80,000 cavalry, 8,000 war chariots, and 6,000 war elephants. However, the Nanda Empire did not have the opportunity to see their army face Alexander, who invaded northwestern India at the time of Dhananda, since Alexander was forced to confine his campaign to the plains of Punjab and Sindh, for his forces mutinied at the river Bees and refused to go any further upon encountering the 4,000 well-trained and well-equipped war elephants of the Gangaride Nanda. According to Diodorus, a possible indication of Nanda military victories in Kalinga is suggested by the later Hathagumpha inscription of Kuruvela, which mentions a king named Nanda building a canal and conquering a place. The existence of a place called now Nandara on the Godavari is taken by some scholars as reflecting Nanda rule over the Deccan. The evidence for the extension of Nanda rule into trans-Vindian India is not, however, strong. Topic. Wealth The Nandas were also renowned for their immense wealth. They undertook irrigation projects and invented standardized measures for trade across their empire, and they ruled with the assistance of many ministers. The Nanda dynasty was also mentioned in the ancient Sangam literature of the Tamil people. The famous Tamil poet Mamalainar described the capital city Pataliputra of the Nanda dynasty and the wealth and treasure that was accumulated by the great Nanda rulers. Their unpopularity, possibly due to their financial extortion, facilitated a revolution, leading to their overthrow by Chandragupta Maurya and Chanakya. Nevertheless, the greatness attained in the Maurya age would hardly have been possible but for the achievements of their predecessors. The Nandas. Topic: List of Nanda rulers. Jaina, Buddhist, and Puranic sources all state that the Nanda kings were nine in all, but they differ in the details. The Buddhist Mahabodhavamsa lists the following as the nine Nandas: Ugrasena, Mahapama Nanda, Panduka, Pandugati, Budapala, Rashtrapala. Govashanaka Dashasadaka Kaivarta Dana Agrams, Zandrames The Puranas claim that the first of the nine, Mahapama was the father, while the rest were his sons. Only one of the sons, Sukalpa, is named. The Buddhist tradition also claims that the later eight were brothers. <laughs> Courtiers Jain and Hindu writers refer to a distinguished line of imperial chancellors or advisors of the king from Kalpaka to Sakatala and Rikshasa. 
The advisors of the king were fewer in number but were most respected on account of their high character and wisdom. They are mentioned by the Greek observers who wrote about conditions in the 4th century BCE. Next to the advisors were the generals of the army. One such, Bhadrasala, is mentioned in the Melinda Panho. The positions were hereditary in Nanda rule. After Sakatala, the minister of 9th Nanda king, died, his son Saint Hulabhadra denied that take up his position and then Sriyaka, his other son, became the minister. In literature A passage of the Kathasaritsagara refers to the Kataka camp of Nanda in Ayodhya. According to the Visarasraini of Maratunga, the Nandas rose to power in 467 BCE. References Notes Citations Sources Jain, Kalash Chand Malwa Through the Ages 1st ed., Mutalal Banarsidass, ISBN 978-81-208-0805-8 Jain, Kalash Chand Lord Mahavira and His Times, Mutalal Banarsidass, ISBN 978-81-208-0805-8 Mukherjee, Radha Kumid first published in 1966, Chandragupta Maurya and His Times 4th ed., Mutalal Banarsidass, ISBN 81-208-0433-3 Panda, Harihar Professor H. C. Raychaudhuri, as a historian, Northern Book Center, ISBN 81-7211-210-6 Raychaudhuri, H. C., Mukherjee, B. N. 1996, Political History of Ancient India, From the Accession of Parikshit to the Extinction of the Gupta Dynasty, Oxford University Press Sastri, K. A. Nilakanta, ed. 1988 Age of the Nandas and Mauryas 2nd ed., Delhi, Mutalal Banarsidass, ISBN 81-208-0465-1 Singh, Upinder, 2016, A History of Ancient and Early Medieval India, From the Stone Age to the Twelfth Century, Pearson Education, ISBN 978-93-325-6996-6 Smith, Vincent A. The Early History of India 3rd ed. Atlantic Publishers and Distributors, ISBN 978-81-7156-618-1